different lineup in 41 games, all competitions. For Pat Noonan this season, he makes two changes from Wednesday night. In the foundation of Oscar Pereira's defensive support, Smith, born and raised in Cincinnati. He'll play right back. Santos more technical. Can they get into second place in the East, which could be important come a conference semifinal? We're underway from TQL Stadium, FC Cincinnati hosting Orlando City. Because you become predictable, then you're uncertain with yourself. Just look at how different Orlando City is now that they're scoring goals and players are filling their roles. Kyle Smith whips in a dangerous ball. Oh, Ramiro Enrique's there. Ten minutes in, wonderful opener from Orlando City. It's the Cincinnati, Ohio native Kyle Smith serving it to Ramiro Enrique. It's this from Kyle Smith. Second balls in good spots, turning over Cincinnati in their defensive third. But then when you get a wide, just prepare it and then whip in an unbelievable pull from Kyle Smith. Enrique's been in great form with six goals in his last 11. Make that 7-12 off a fantastic assist from Kyle Smith. Orlando City is on. Yedlin had to settle that. It was hit with so much pace. Now Powell from distance cleared away. Only as far as Buka. Acosta, Kelsey, well wide. Onto the feet of his right there. But what Enrique is trying to do is clear a point of view for his goalkeeper in Galeza. Finally ready. Acosta around the wall and couldn't quite bend it in. Acosta, Assad, back across, Buka! Just couldn't get the power behind it. And got into a really dangerous spot. They go quick, flag is down, Enrique, oh, Roman Celentano! A spectacular save, he's asking for offside, the flag remained down, it's a corner. Celentano and FC Cincinnati have to defend this corner, Torres will serve. Oh, Celentano ran in to Muriel, it's put in, it's a good goal for now, it's Enrique's second! And now it has been called off. It seems it was a, there's a lot of confusion. And said it was a foul from Muriel. Now the question I have is Celentano's coming out. Oh yeah, absolutely. In my opinion, Muriel runs into Celentano. And I'm a little surprised it took that long yeah. to blow. Pursuit of space. They're going to put out fires. They're going to be hard in tackles. They're just difficult to play against. Hadebe cuts it back. Acosta. Acosta! A moment out of nowhere. A moment of brilliance from the reigning MVP, Luciano Acosta. A moment of brilliance. FC Cincinnati needed that, but they get the help from Orlando City's goalkeeper, Pedro Galese. He gets caught cheating the wrong way. And part of that is because there's so many bodies in front of him, he looks for the angle, and right at that split second, Acosta comes across his body, and it's 1-1. 14 goals, 19 assists, a season after being MVP. Take a bow, Acosta, you have put Kyle Smith, another service. Ramiro settling. Angulo! Oh! oh no. It snuck under Celentano. He made a spectacular save in the first half, but an error here in the second. Orlando take the lead back two to one. This is 100% a gift from Roman Celentano. Unequivocally, that ball cannot hit the back of the net, but Ivan Angulo. Buka back to Acosta and Kubo back to Acosta. Broken up, too many Orlando City defenders in the way. And not enough Cincinnati players moving off the ball. Orashano! Short hop into Galese who makes the save. Smith towards Torres, flicked on. Orishano collecting. Oh boy, it's a poor giveaway. It's a tap in. It's three for Orlando. 
They can feel home field advantage. And frankly, it might be being given to them by FC Cincinnati tonight. Or Rashano, the mistake, three to one Orlando lead. Cincinnati has looked like tonight and over the past couple of weeks. Buka for Kubo. Kubo trying, and it takes a deflection. Galese reacts. Assad to Baird. Back to Yamil Assad. Assad trying at Galese. Big save. That came on to him quick. And he was able to push it away. Orashano into Baird. Back toward Orashano. Orashano again, Galese. Kubo leaving it. Acosta trying to keep it away from Torres. Nobody again kind of making that run for him. He will get it on, uh, get on it in the end though. Acosta into Baird. Back to Acosta. Three Orlando defenders. He somehow holds off all of them. Oh, it's still Acosta. My goodness. My it's goodness. Wide. Where it's about being at your best at the end of the year into the Audi MLS Cup playoffs. How many times has the team that has been hot won the cup? Here's Torres. He's in for a fourth. Celentano making a save. Getting it back from Valenzuela. Orashano. Orashano. Lace will catch comfortably. It was right at him in the end. So he's on the ground for the foul. It created this and will be on it for the free kick. It is Orashano and it's over. And that is the final whistle. Orlando City, a 10th win in 13 since July 1st.